Talmud Bavli Gemara Brachot um, Perik Rishon Amud Zain Aleph Page 7a Starting from the top of the page Amar Rabbi Yochanan Mishum Rabbi Yose Rabbi Yochanan said in the name of Rabbi Yose Minayin Shakadosh Baruch Hu Palel From where do we know that Hakadosh Baruch Hu prays Shnemar I'll bring them to my holy mountain and make them joyful in the house of my prayer. It doesn't say their prayer, but rather my prayer. From here we learn the Holy One blessed is he prays. What does he pray? Rav Zutra Batovia said in the name of Rav, Yehirat Som Milfanai, may it be my will, Sheikh Beshu Rachme et Kasi, that my mercy conquer my anger, Vayagolu Rachme al Midotai, and that my mercy overcome my uh, stern attribute, Veet Naheg im Banai Bemidat Rachamim, and that I behave towards my children with the attribute of mercy. Vekanes Lahem Lifni Mishurat Hadin, and that for their sake, I go beyond the boundary of judgment. Tanya, who was taught in a brisa, Amar Rabbi Ishmael ben Elisha. Rabbi Ishmael ben Elisha said, One time, on Yom Kippur, that is, I entered inside the Holy of Holies to burn incense. Bereiti Akatriel Ya Hashem Tzvaot. And I saw Achtariel. Ka Hashem Tvakot, Shehu Yoshev Al Kiseh Ranganisa, sitting on a high and lofty throne, Vamali, and God said to me, Yishmael Beni Bacheni, Yishmael, my son, bless me. Amati Lo, I said to him, Yeratzamu Fanecha, may be your will. Shikh Beshu Rachmecha Ekasecha, that your mercy conquer your anger. Vyagolu Rachmecha Al Midotecha, and that your mercy overcome your stern attributes, Vititznaheg in Banecha, Bimi Data Rachabim, and that you behave toward your children with the attribute of mercy. Vitikanes Lahem, Lifnim Mishurat Hadin, and that for their sake you go beyond the boundary of judgment. Vini Ana Li Berosho, he nodded to me with his head, showing his approval. Vakamashmalan, Rabbi Ishmael informs us that the blessing given by ordinary by an ordinary person should never be unimportant in your eyes. And we'll just uh, scroll down. So we're currently at the first at the end of the first white line at Be'inecha. Scroll down. We're starting from the Amar Rabbi Yochanan at the top. Amar Rabbi Yochanan Mishum Rabbi Yossi. Rabbi Yochanan said in the name of Rabbi Yossi, Minay she'ein meratzin lo le'adam bishat kaso. From where do we know that one should not attempt to appease a man at the moment of Tichtiv, it's written, Panay yelcho v'hanichoti lach. My face will go and I'll give you rest. Meaning, Amar lo hakadosh baruch hu lemashe. Hamten li ad sheavru panim shel zaam. Wait until my countenance of anger passes. Vaniach lecha, and then I shall give you rest. Umi ka ritcha kame dekucha brichu. And is there anger? Uh, or does the hakadosh baruch hu uh, display anger? Ain yes. Titania was taught in a brisa, Ve'elzo'em bechol yom, God is angered every day, Ve'chamazamo, and how long does his anger last? Rega, a moment. Ve'chamarega, how long is is a moment? Echad mechameshet ribot ushmonat alafim ushmone meot ushmonim ushmona besha'a. 158,888th part of an hour. Vezohi rega. This is a moment. Ve'ein kol bria yechola lechavein ota sha'a. And no creature can determine precisely when this moment occurs. Chutz mi bilam harasha, except for balam, the wicked one. 
Dichtibay, for it's written regarding Bilam, Veodea da'at Elyon, and who knows the mind of the, of the Supreme One? Hashta da'at behem, behem tolo havayada. Now he did not know uh, what was on his own animal's mind. Da'at Elyon havayada. How could he have known what was on the mind of Hashem? Elam Elamed, rather, this first teaches us. That he knew how to ascertain or determine the exact moment at which HaKadosh Baruch Hu becomes angry. And this is what the Prophet Micha said to Israel. Ami zachana mayaat balak melech moav v'gomer. My people remember please what Balak king of Moab plotted. What does it mean so that you may realize the benevolence of Hashem? This is the continuation of the verse. Amar Rabbi Elazar, Amar lahem hakadosh baruch hu leIsrael, the Holy One blessed to say said to Israel, Deul kamat zrakot asitio imachem. Realize how many benevolences I bestowed upon you. Shelok asti bimei bilam harasha, in that I did not become angry in the days of, of the wicked bilam. When he was wanted to curse you, she ill malika asti. For I had I become angry, lo nishtaya mi sonehem shall Israel sarid ufalit. No remnant whatsoever would have remained from the enemies of Israel. Vahenu to kama le le bilam levalak, and this is the meaning of that which Bilam said to Balak, ma ekov lo kabo el. How can I curse? God has not cursed. Uma es om lo zaam Hashem. And how can I anger? Hashem has not become angry. Malamed shekolo tan hayimim lo zaam. This teaches. This teaches that throughout all those days, Hashem did not become angry. Vechama zamo. And how long does his anger last? Rega. A moment. Vechama rega. And how long is a moment? Amar Rabbi Avin. Veita. The itema Rabbi Avina. Some say it was Rabbi Rabbi Avina. Rega kememre. A moment is equal to the time it actually takes to say the word rega. Um nalan de rega ratach. And from where do we know that he is angry for a moment? Kshnema ki rega ba'apochaim birtonof. For his anger induced but a moment. His favor extends for a lifetime. The ba'itema mahaka mahaka. Or if you prefer, say from here. Chavi kimat rega ad yaavar zaam. Hard for a moment until anger passes. The aim matratach. And when does God God become angry? Amar Abaye, bahanach tlat shae kam kamyata. During the first three hours, ki chivara, the first three hours of the day, ki chivara kar kabalta de tanagola. When the comb of a rooster Becomes pale, the ka the ka a achad karaa and it stands on one foot. Kol shata ve shata nami ka hachi. Many other times the rooster stands like this. Kol shata it be shurai shurai yeke somake. At all these times there are red streaks in it. Be hachi shata late be shurai yeke somake. And at this time there is no red streaks in it. Hahu tzidokei mina dava bishvavutei de Rabbi Yoshua ben Levi. There was a certain heretic, a Sadducee, a tziduk, who was in the neighborhood of Rabbi Yoshua ben Levi. Hava kametza er le tova bikira e, who used to constantly harass Rabbi Yoshua by citing scriptural verses. Um, and yoma yoma chad. Shakal Tanagola Okmei Bain Kare de Arsa. One day Rabbi Yosho took a rooster and tied it between the feet of his bed, the Aimbe and stared at it, Savar he thought, Ki Mataha he shata when that moment comes meaning when it when the comb becomes pale and stands on one foot, Alate I will curse him, I will curse the heretic. Ki Mataha he shata nayem. When that moment came, however, Rabbi Yeshua dozed off. Amar, Rabbi Yeshua said, Shema love orach ar'ah lemevad hachi. 
you can uh, understand from this that it is not proper to do it or for a tzaddik to to uh, curse to make a curse it is written, His mercies are upon all his creatures. And it's also written, Also for the righteous, to punish is not good. Tana Mishmei de Rabbi Meir, a brace was taught in the name of Rabbi Meir. When the sun shines in the morning, and all the pagan kings, all the kings of the east and west, place their crowns on their heads and bow to the sun. The holy one blessed is he immediately becomes angry. Tova mardut achat bilibosheladam. adam. A single impulse of self-discipline in the heart of a person is better. Your term become malkuyot than many lashes. Shnema, for it says, veritva et me ahaveha vegomer, and he shall pursue her lovers. The amra elcha vashuva el ish harishon kitov li az meata. Then she will say, I will go and return to my first husband, for it is better for me than it then than it is now. Bresh Lakishama Yoter Mimea Malkuyot It's actually better than one hundred lashes. That is self reproach is better than one hundred lashes. Shnema Tchat Gaara Bemevin Mehakot Ksil Mea The humbleness of reproof is more evident in an understanding in an understanding man than a hundred lashes in a fool. Sorry, at this point uh, we are at Chsil Mea and we'll just scroll down to the bottom. So we're starting at the top in the middle from Va'ama Rabbi Yochanan, right there. Va'ama Rabbi Yochanan, Mishum Rabbi Yossi, and Rabbi Yochanan said in the name of Rabbi Yossi, Shlosh Advarim B'Kesh Moshe L'Milifnei HaKadosh Baruch Hu. Moshe requested three things from HaKadosh Baruch Hu, V'Natano, and God granted them to him. B'Kesh Yitishrei Shechina Al Yisrael, he requested that the Shina rests on Israel, Benatano, and God granted this. Shinema, as it stated, Halo Belechtecha Imanu. Unless you accompany us. Bikeshalo Tishre Shina al of of De Kochavim, he requested that the Shina should not rest on other nations of the world. Benatano. God granted him. Shinema Viniflinu Ani and I and your people will be made distinct. He requested that he make known to him the ways of Hakadosh Baruch Hu. This is in regard to dispensing judgment. He and God granted him the request. Make your ways known to me. Amalefanav, Moshe said before God, Ribbonu Shalolam, Master of the Universe, Mipnei Mayesh Tzadik Vetov Lo. What is the reason there are righteous people for whom things are good? Yesh Tzadik Vera Lo. And there are righteous people for whom things are bad. Yesh Rasha Vetov Lo. There are wicked people for whom things are good. Yesh Rasha Vera Lo. And there are wicked people for whom things are bad. Amal Lo Moshe, God said to him, Moshe, Tzadik v'tov lo tzadik ben tzadik. A righteous person for whom things are good is a righteous person, the son of a righteous person. Tzadik v'ra lo tzadik ben rasha. A righteous person for whom things are bad is a righteous person, the son of a wicked person. Rasha v'tov lo rasha ben tzadik. A wicked person for whom things are good is a wicked person, the son of a righteous person. Rasha v'ro lo v'ra rasha v'ra. Lo Rasha Ben Rasha. 
A wicked person for whom things are bad is a wicked person, the son of a wicked person. Amamar, the master said, Sadiq Vatovlo, Sadiq ben Sadiq. A righteous person for whom things are good is a righteous person, the son of a righteous person. Sadiq Vera, Lot Sadiq, Sadiq Vera, Lot Sadiq ben Rasha. A righteous person for whom things are bad is a righteous person, the son of a wicked person. Aini, is it so that your fortune is dependent upon your father? Vehaktiv, it's written, Poked avon avot al banim, visiting the son, the sins of the fathers upon the sons. Uchtiv, ubanim lo yom tu al avot, and it's written, and sons shall not be put to death because of their fathers. Veraminan kerae ahada de, and we pointed out a contradiction between these two verses. Umashninan, and we answered, Lokasha, there is no difficulty. Ha kesha o chazin maase of avotehem bi dehem. This is where the sons retain their father's sinful practices. Ha kesha e no chazin maase of avotehem bi dehem. This is where the sons do not retain their father's sinful practices. Ele hachi kamale, rather, this is what God said to Moses. Tzadik vetov lo tzadik gamor, a righteous person for whom things are good is a, compl- is a completely righteous person. Tzadik vera lo tzadik sheino gamor, a righteous person for whom things are bad is a righteous person who is not completely righteous. Rasha vetov lo rasha sheino gamor, a wicked person for whom things are good is a wicked person who is not completely wicked. Rasha vera lo rasha gamor, a wicked person for whom things are bad is a wicked person who is completely wicked. Ufliga de Rabbi Meir, and Rabbi Yossi disagrees with Rabbi, Rabbi Meir. De Amma Rabbi Meir. Shtaim natnulo. Two of these requests are granted to him. Vachat lo natnulo. Whereas one was not granted to him. Shenemar, as it stated, Vachanoti et asher achon. I shall show favor to him I choose to show favor. Meaning, Afal pi she'eno hagon. Even though he may be unfit, to be shown favor, Rikhanti et asher achem, and I shall show mercy to whom I choose to show mercy, meaning afal pi sheino agon, even though he may be unfit, even though he may be unfit. Biyome lo tuchal lirotet panai, he said, you will not be able to see my face. Tana mishme de Rabbi Yoshua ben Karcha, Bryce was taught in the name of Rabbi Yoshua ben Karcha, Kachamalo Hakadosh Baruchola Moshe. This is what the Holy One, blessed is he, said to Moshe. Kesheratiti Loratita, when I wanted uh, to reveal myself to you, you did not want. Now that you want, now that you want to see me, I do not want to show you. Ufliga de Rabbi Shmuel bar Nachmani, Amar Rabbi Yonatan, and Rabbi Yashua ben Kocha disagrees with this. Um, with uh, what Rabbi Shoba Nachmani said in the name of Rabbi said in the name of Rabbi Yonatan, to Amar Rabbi Shmuel bar Nachmani, Amar Rabbi Yonatan, for Rabbi Shmuel bar Nachmani said in the name of Rabbi Yonatan, Bischal Shalosh Zacha Shleshalosh. In a word for three uh, things, he merited three things. This is at the time of the burning bush, at the time of the. Um, Bischa veyaster Moshe Panav, in word for and Moses hid his face. Zachal liklaster Panim, he merited the sh- his shining face. Bischa ki yare, in word for for he was afraid. Zachal le vayiru migeshet elav, he merited and they feared to approach him. Bischa mehabit, in word for to gaze. Zecha le utmunat Hashem yabit. He merited at the image of God does he gaze. Vasirotiet kapi veraitiet acharai. Then I shall remove my hand and you will see my back. Amar Rav Chanabar Bizna, Amar Rabbi Shimon Chasida. Melamed shehar hera hagadosh parochu le Moshe Keshe shel tfilin. This teaches that the Holy One, blessed is he, showed Moshe the knot of the tefillin on the back of the head. 
Every single statement uttered by the by Kadosh Baruch Hu in someone's favor, I feel al tnai even if on a condition lo he did not rescind minan minalan. From where do we know this? Mi Moshe Rabbeinu from Moshe Atichah Shnema. Heref mi meni ve ashmidem ve gomer. Release me and I shall destroy them. Ve seotcha legoyatum and I shall make you a mighty nation. Af al gav dva Moshe rachmeala dimla dimilta uve uvatla. Even though Moses prayed for mercy concerning this matter and it was voided, I feel hachi okma bazare. Even so, the promise um, to Moshe was fulfilled in his descendants. Shneemar, as it stated, B'nai Moshe Gershom ve'Eliezer, the sons of Moses Gershom and Eliezer, Be'yu B'nai Eliezer Rachavia Harosh ve'Gomer, the sons of Eliezer Rachavia the chief, Uvnei Rachavia Ravu Lema'ala ve'Gomer, and the sons of Rachavia were exceedingly numerous, Ravu Lema'ala. Betane Rabbi Yosef and Rabbi Yosef taught a Baraisa, the Malami Shishim Rabbi Ribo. The descendants of Rechavia were more than 600,000. Atya Rivya Rivya. This is derived by Gezeira Shava um, regarding the word Rivya or Ravu, numerous. Ketiv Hacha Ravu Lamaala. It is written here, exceedingly numerous. That's about. Rechavia's descendants. Uchtiv hatam uvnei Israel paru v'yishretu v'yibo and it's written there and the children of Israel were fruitful, teamed and became numerous. And because we know that they were, they were you know, because we know that they were uh, that the children of Israel were 600,000 therefore uh, Ravu l'ma'ala is more than 600,000. So Ribu must mean 600,000. That's the end of the page.